Dude, that could have really hurt. More exciting singles action as we continue here tonight at Bar Wrestling as we work hard and play hard. Jamie Senegal squaring off against the starlet of Bar Wrestling, Heather Monroe. The Killer Bay, if you will. Now, I, I mean, even though Heather Monroe is the Killer Bay and she is the stalwart of the, the woman stalwart of this company, Jamie is a. I share a name with Jamie, so I'm going to be a little. I'm going to be a little partial. You resemble that remark, as Gorilla Monsoon would say. <laughs> would you stop? You resemble that remark. Would you stop? Right now, Heather Monroe taking control over the punk rock princess? Was that what I heard? That's exactly really? what I heard. It's the centerfold in your dad's secret magazine. Punk? Well, we, were, we were listening to Fugazi a little earlier, so uh, the bar wrestling faithful are definitely familiar with the underground music scene. Uh, but how is Jamie going to fare against Heather here in a, in, a, in a wrestling match. This is a new opponent for Heather. You know, Jamie's a fairly new addition to the bar wrestling family. Coming straight up. I mean, first of all, uh, he's coming out of Coming out of nowhere with those splits, first off. <laughs> Can't even finish my sentence before this guy does something. Showing how those manicures do it in Philly, PA. Heather had something for him.
Heather proving that she can go, she's not scared to go up top and take some risks as well. Heather is a well-rounded athlete. We've seen so much from her in just these past few years. She has become the star, like I've said, the stalwart of bar wrestling, the leader of the women's division as far as I'm concerned. And she's showing no signs of stopping, including against Jamie Senegal. She is giving up a little bit of size. So she's gonna have to take some risk there, rely on her speed and her quickness, her guile, her elusiveness in that ring. Now, did you say Jamie's from Philadelphia? Yes, she, he is from, well, she, as it were, is from Philly she. PA, and yet, and by the way, a history in cheerleading, so that is gonna serve her well. well I'm noticing, uh, I think that looks like an Ultramantis black t-shirt. An extreme face buster off the top rope from Jamie. Looking the leg now. Now Jamie may look glamorous, her makeup is done incredibly, but this woman is known, he is known, she is known for the deathmatch scene. She is not afraid to pull out a few light tubes and light them up. Heather is, uh, she's, a, she's a proud member of, of the Four Locos here in bar wrestling. You don't get that moniker easily. God, you could hear that all the way at the Staples Center from here. You can hear the, the collective groan <laughs> here at the bootleg theater. Heather taking some serious damage they from Jamie so they're far. They're feeling her pain. Heather's been able to keep up with Jamie, but Jamie has been dominant this entire match. Well, certainly taking a lot of punishment here, only a two count there. And uh, well, Heather's known for taking punishment. I mean, that's why she got the moniker Killer Bay. She's, they don't come any tougher. Killer Bay, Heather Monroe has come out from deeper, deeper circumstances than this. But at the same time, I've never seen her grounded this early. I've never seen her this winded this early. Jamie has her number early. Jamie, from my opinion, has studied tape, has studied the, 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 the the weaponized, well, you, I can't even put it into words. Well, Jamie, I think what you're trying to say here is that no matter how much studying you do, how much preparation you, you can do, all the, the tape homework you, you can. And when you're going to have to forgive here me. Here comes the cover. Uh, no, only a two count. But when, once you get in the ring underneath these hot lights, the crowd, the sweat, the tears, the cameras, all that goes out the window. Extremely, and you're gonna have to forgive me. I mean, the, the sight of Jamie Senegal is just flustering me. I've never seen a competitor like this before, especially in bar wrestling. Jamie Senegal is a sight to behold, that is for sure. But, uh, I mean, we expect nothing less. There are, there are no promotions that are more colorful or extravagant or eclectic than bar wrestling. And you can't, oh, hold on. Heather's, uh, I mean, hey, you know. Repaid in kind, my friend. Repaid in kind. She's just showing that she can give it right back to Jamie Senegal. Now Jamie on the receiving end of some punishment. I think Heather considers herself a, a gatekeeper here at Bar Wrestling. If you want to make a name for yourself here at Bar, you got to get past her, and she takes pride in that. Killer Bay using that killer backside right to the face of Jamie Senegal. Quick cover. Since Heather has entered the singles ranks, she has skyrocketed. I only see the I only see upwards for Heather Monroe. I mean, I've spent time with Heather Monroe in championship wrestling from Hollywood. I was part of a stable with her, with upper class. I got to know the woman, and she is ruthless. There is nothing this woman won't do to get a win, whether it be against somebody local or somebody from Philly, Philly, such as Jamie Senegal. These hands are universal, as a, as a monster among men would say. Heather has improved so much leaps and bounds, and in such a short period of time, too. She's got the technique and the mannerisms of someone who's been wrestling way, way longer than she has. And if you follow her, she studies. She's in the gym every day. She's studying and trying to better herself. But she's going to seem to have to be a lot more in the gym, in the dojos, to try to get take on Jamie Senegal. 
Jamie Senegal with some unorthodox offense. A springboard German suplex of some sort. And Heather follows it kind of with a snap suplex as well. My thoughts exactly. Is about to count eight. Strong right arm from Heather. Chop for chop, blow for blow. Tempers are flaring up here, but who's gonna get the better of this exchange? Jamie with a palm strike and a quick, quick lariat. Another one. Jamie Senegal now with Heather in a reverse DDT position, drops the leg, covers her. But no, does not hook a leg. Heather barely gets the, barely gets the shoulder up, but this is where Heather is gonna struggle right now. I've said at the beginning of the match, Heather has never seen an opponent like Jamie Senegal before, and he is doing things that, frankly, I have never seen before. I don't think you've seen before. I don't think this audience has seen before. Definitely, Jamie uh, was a little cocky there, I think, a little too much confidence thinking that he had Heather pinned. She was not finished. Heather with her first of the small cradle. Almost stacking Jamie up. She almost had him there within an eyelash. Springboard code breaker from Heather Monroe. Heather hooked the leg. She had she had her hand, she was on the shoulders. Heather, Heather was pretty sure that was gonna do it, but she needs to string together a, a couple more moves here. Because Jamie Senegal has Proven to become a very resilient opponent thus Jamie, far. Jamie taking everything Heather has to throw at her. Quick arm drag. Heather meets the boot. Tit for tat, no pun intended. This is going all out, balls to the wall. Can Heather score a pinfall here? No, not yet. Too early as Jamie continues to kick out. Almost uh, almost a Gumby-like state at this point. I mean, it's just folded up as like, like an accordion I as mean, Jamie. I, I don't know, I wouldn't call that a fetal position. I don't know what I would call that. Crumpled up like a car accident. Heather now trying to go for some sort of coup de gras. With the roll up, kick out. Wait, 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 wait! That was oh, a two. that was so close. Referee that says two. That was so close. Referee but says two. That was two. two. Rev, rev, referee Isaac Hayes. No relation to Chef. Close, close pinfalls in this contest so far. This is anybody's match tonight. We are getting down now uh, to the nitty gritty here. Heather is showing serious signs of strain right now. She's not able, even able to get to her feet. She is using Jamie's knee pads to get up onto her knees. Tough predicament to be in if you're Heather Monroe right now. She's frustrated, she's tried everything. A final flurry from the Killer Bay. If this doesn't put it away, then I she, she. Heather now dumping Jamie right on his head, her head, and gets the wow. three count. Out of nowhere, Heather Monroe with the driver out of nowhere, putting away Jamie Senegal. Monroe. I did not see that coming, Loudon. <laughs> 
still the queen of bar wrestling, Heather Monroe.